um, everyone, you know, even yeah, though it was I, really just the people, the powers that be that started it all. Yeah. Ooh, we got uh, Nago versus Gold Lewis here. Test your luck, who we've seen before, and Big Booty Man four four five, who uh, we've seen around before, but not today. Mankind knew mm -hmm. that they cannot change society. Yeah, Both we'll coming up out here in losers round four. Dual one. Yeah, two uh, large people. Right here. Two big boys. Uh, Nago is definitely the less big boy, able to really you know, nimbly dash around, but of course he has to pay the price in blood, and it looks like he is just on the edge of bursting here. Oh, yeah. Ooh, oh, cool. speaking of burst. Yeah. Bit of a Freudian flip that commentators uh, <laughs> cursed him. Uh, here's the Gold Lewis part pressure. No one knows how to deal with this. Gold Lewis players will tell you to mash, and then you will explode. Yeah, lots of spacing traps, lots of frame traps. Um, oh no, that's gonna kill. Yeah. That was tough. It really looked like, uh, you know, Booty Man's patience was gonna win him the day there, but uh, two blood-sucking universes will uh, ruin anybody's day. I mean, look at that. Any meter he can build, he's just trying to FD not go out with. Definitely uh, feels like a very uphill matchup for Gold Lewis until the blood gets high. I'm waiting for the, uh, you know, full bird, screen though. drone. Oh, yeah. I feel like drone. <gasps> oh, oh, no. Not my full blood touch meter. The gauge. <gasps> Burn it down, I'm baby. Really interesting. Yeah. Not enough meter to FD it out. I'm so guilty of that. I never look at blood when it matters. Like, mm -hmm. I'm always like mid combo and then just get blown away. Yeah. How much can one man block? This oh, is I tough because both players are really staying down each other's throats, too. So, <laughs> yeah, he hasn't really gotten to uh, toss drone. That full screen punish. You know, people complain about, um, at me, I complain about Gold Lewis, like, not even really having to guess right on his pressure uh, to get that huge chip damage. But we saw there that Nago's Nerals can do just the same, and that tap dust finishes it off. I mean, yeah, anybody who can keep you in a uh, block string half the match is, is going to be privileged in terms of uh, you being forced to FD less to, you know, take half your health and meter. Well, but... Um... Well, because Naga's uh, normals do chip damage at high blood, and so mm -hmm. do the guard crushing things, and so it's it's a unique privilege that like basically only these two characters have. Um, guard crush definitely a controversial uh, mechanic. I don't think it's. Mm -hmm. I think it's. I understand why it's in the game, but like a lot of Guilty Gear's defensive mechanics are a little yeah. unique, anyways. Mm -hmm. I think it's bad on Gold Lewis. I think as a mechanic, it's a fine idea. Goldust. Yeah, definitely frustrating. People have talked about just feeling like they can't lab against this character and don't really want to learn how to operate him to better be able to lab. Mm -hmm. Totally. All right, there's Drone for the first time, making making his appearance. Go get him, buddy. <laughs> Test your luck a oh. bit on the back foot here uh, over at level three blood. Yeah, early DDs uh, starting to catch out. Test your luck in neutral. But that's a clear counterplay there. Yeah, that's tough. A high blood tester like feeling very content to just sit back and wait, and it's working out for him. Uh, Big booty man, you know, taking these risks to get in and getting punished for it. Ooh. Oh, back that's nothing came of it, of but uh, decently clean just blocks. Uh oh. I don't know if this is going to oh kill my him. God. Yeah, that combo started very fight, early. But... There we go. I was, I, I, was in I really thought he'd back throw in the corner, although, you know, when, when your damage is that high, I guess you might as well go for it. Mm -hmm. Speaking of high damage... Ooh, Burst about to come back for Big Booty Man. Not quite on the table for Tester Luck yet. Ooh, Nago just trying to backdash, not wanting to block these at all. Burn it down. Oh, that man's been watching backpack videos. Is that a is that was that an overhead? Was that one of those ambiguous 
uh, secret overheads, or was that just a low that Homie failed to block? <laughs> I am not mm. actually sure. I was. Uh, what is that? His six. His six H. I think the big coffin swing. Yeah, six H into into like one of the swing downs. I guess it would be yeah. low because he didn't flip. So he just didn't block the low. Uh, I so block like, every uh, Gold Lewis coffin from the direction it's coming from, no matter what. I'm just, I'm like, I'm not taking the risk. I don't know. It might be a mid. <laughs> it's like how I always block a Fujir Arc High, despite uh, they'll never make that an overhead. Well, if you stand block it, it's less plus. So you can you can challenge it more likely after if you stand block. Well, yeah, I suppose that is a, a decent offensive or defensive idea, anyways. Ooh, Big Booty Man's risk looking. Oh no, Fuki is right out of range of that. Yeah, now you're stuck in the rainbow. Interesting, burn it down. Oh, come on, you can't make it that obvious. <laughs> yeah, I really tried to, well, he had high blood, you know, he really had to steal it if he wanted to uh, mix big booty and get the end of the game. Ooh, excellent fake out overhead into the low. Doesn't get the round. Big Moody Band has been consistently um, backdashing out of these like semi fake uh, Fukios forwards when really I think you need to just be checking them, right? Because they're not real things, right? I wonder if he uh, clashed or traded earlier on in the match and just doesn't feel confident in Gold Lewis's buttons as like, mm -hmm. you know, really able to react to Fukio well. Yeah, because I guess Fukio does have that low profile and so. Yeah, Gold Lewis 5P might not be the best option. Yeah, I'd have to run the footage back. Perhaps he, he already tried that and lost. Mm -hmm. Oh, there we go. There we are. Somebody's yeah. listening to stream. <laughs> Ooh, test your luck. Can't keep this offense going forever. They're going to burst in a minute. Ooh. Running all the way back, getting danger. He doesn't need it. Nago damage is uh, high enough without the meter. <laughs> yeah, drops that combo. Oh, that's bad. It's tough. I mean, Gold Lewis obviously wants to represent that jump D. It is pretty privileged, but uh, 2H is a war crime of a button as well, so that'll do just fine. I'm. These burn it downs are very interesting. I'm wondering, did they buff it this patch? Uh, I don't. I don't think so. Interesting. It's just really good. I think he just um, wants to get Nago over to him, right? Like, he's, yeah, he's, he's tired of being kept out by those big fat buttons. He's like, hey, man, get over here. Yeah. All right, test your luck up to nil, to one, to nil. Uh, to nil, I, to one. To okay. one. Goodness, yeah. Sorry, I, I'm, I'm sorry so for doubting you, big booty man. <laughs> <laughs> I would never, yeah. This is a, a, definitely a frustrating thing about some characters can be how it, you know, it feels like from round start, they're just able to get you to the corner pretty trivially. I think Ram is definitely one people like to complain about, but uh, Nago can definitely feel that way as well. It's just like the second you block something from him, Big Booty Man is just forced down into the corner. Ooh, with 2H. Oh, I think you got it. I guess I'm not sure what you would have punished that with, but. Yeah. Hey, right, Booty Man. Yeah, big booty man looking to load Ooh. the bases here. Can't no wall break, yeah, but test your luck with no there. blood. Mm -hmm. I lied, look at all that blood, good lord. Oh, he excellent can... check. Uh, 5P. What an offensive burst, too. Even if test your luck wins this, uh, big booty man still has another round where test your luck will not have burst. Mm -hmm. Bit bold. Getting ran back the full length of the screen here. Already worked into the other corner. Uh. Oh, the, t the Longhorn's about to cook. Got the bucket. <gasps> oh! Oh! Wow. What an insane window, right? Between drone and the low. You gotta have the fuzzy timings. Oh my god, another one just like that we saw last round. Oh no, Big Booty Man might even not have the chance to use Burst here if uh, they keep going down to these throws. 
Yeah, Tester Luck has really just been conditioned this whole game. Like, you have to keep blocking, you have to block it out, but... Yeah, that's great set strategy. Mm -hmm. uh, I think you gotta run the offensive gold burst. Oh no, that's gonna be it. Oh, and the yeah. high altitude burst gets punished. Yeah, there was nothing you could do there. That 2H, such a huge disjoint. Yeah, great play there by Tester Luck, especially at the end, you know, just coming out, making the adaptation and just uh, definitively putting Big Booty Man down. Yeah, totally. Yeah, that's 3-1. Yeah, good looking. Tester Luck, uh, not quite in top eight yet. They're going to go into uh, Losers Round 5 against Kim Key. Kim Key.